simple and complex machines. We use machines to make work easier. When we think about machines, we usually imagine a complex machine like a computer. However, there is another type of machine, simple machines. Simple machines have no moving parts or few moving parts. Inclined plane. An inclined plane is a surface that goes from a low level to a high level. We use it to move heavy objects up and down. Screw. We use screws to hold things together and also to lift objects. When we put simple machines together, we make a complex machine. Pulley. We use a pulley when we have to lift or lower something heavy. A pulley uses a wheel and a rope to lift an object. Wheel and axle. This simple machine is made up of a wheel which turns around an axle. We use it to move things across the ground more easily or to apply force more easily. Lever. A lever is made up of a rigid bar and a fulcrum. When we push one end of the lever down, the opposite end moves up. It is easier to lift an object when we use a lever. Wedge. A wedge is an object with a slanted surface, like an inclined plane. When we push down on the flat part of a wedge, we can cut things easily. We can also use a wedge to stop something moving. Wedge. What do you think prehistoric people used wedges for? Prehistoric people used tools that contained wedges, axes, spears, knives, scrapers, etc. They used these tools to cut things. Inventions. It is very difficult to imagine a world without machines. Inventions usually begin as an idea and are created later. As time passes, people improve and change the inventions to make them better. Steam engine. The invention of the steam engine started the industrial revolution. The engine used water vapor or steam to do work. The steam engine powered trains and ships. It also powered machines in factories. Telegraph. The invention of the telegraph meant that people could communicate by sending coded messages. It was the fastest way of communicating over long distances. What did we use before smartphones? We used mobile phones and telephones which were fixed to a specific place in the house. These phones were only used for making calls and sending text messages in the case of mobile phones. Which machine comes between the telegraph and the smartphone? 
the telephone and the mobile phone. Remember, machines can be classified into simple and complex machines. Simple machines have few or no moving parts. An inclined plane helps move objects up and down different levels. A pulley lifts and lowers heavy objects. A lever is used to push objects up or down. A wedge cuts or separates objects. A screw holds two objects together. It is made of wedges and inclined planes. A wheel and axle is used to transport things easily. A complex machine is made up of two or more simple machines which together perform a different function. Inventions have caused many changes in different aspects of life, like transport and communication. Steam engines were used in trains to make the first steam trains, which caused the transport revolution. Now, there are cars, aeroplanes and electric trains which travel much longer distances, faster and better than before. The telegraph was an invention which caused the communication revolution. Today, there are smartphones thanks to this invention. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, click like and make sure to subscribe for more. Bye bye.